The pandemic put many local artists out of work, but a Portland creative and entrepreneur just reopened a space for them to showcase their work and for all of us to enjoy. So let's take a trip to Rainbow City. I can see the light in other people when they come here. Take a step inside Rainbow City. And people kind of walk in and they're like, how did I not know about this? Take a bunch of pictures. A playground for all ages, doused in neon, just off Burnside and 11th in Southeast Portland. There are at least 80 people just actively involved, you know, just dropping in time to time at all hours to, to do their thing. And we are looking for more. Rainbow City is an event space for creativity and the brainchild of an artist with a name almost as colorful as the walls around her, Strawberry Pickles. I do super abstract, like super, if you can't tell, brightly colored art. Rainbow City first opened its doors in February 2020, but we all know what came next. And then COVID hit and we were like, just stopped in our tracks, just like everything ended because we were mostly a venue too. We're all DJs and producers and music makers. A lot of like our business was shows and things like that. And we didn't really have a huge backup plan. More than a passion for Strawberry, she's invested everything, including her own home. Because I could never find an investor or that, you know, magical funding to come through, I did. I, I thought about it long and hard and after a year of searching for a way, I knew that I had to sell my house. Now she's back open and ready to take you somewhere over the rainbow, collaborating with artists and food carts. Game night, we have a night for live, you know, live streaming. We have ecstatic dance and it's just, and we do yoga as well. There is just a way for people to have an outlet in the community. And it's a shopping paradise for unique local finds. Aromatherapy, um, candles, we have jewelry, we have, um, you know, people who do healing arts. We have people who give, um, you know, just give back to the community by offering free classes. Growing up in Portland, she hopes to elevate the identity of the city she loves and the artists who make it so special. I like to think of us as kind of like these candles. And, you know, if you see someone kind of burning out, you just go around and, and help light them back up. And it, it works. You can see it in action here. It's beautiful, really. Rainbow City is now open seven days a week from 3 until 11. Their next event is coming up on Tuesday. The Sword Society is holding a lightsaber and Nerf sword event for adults and kids alike. It sounds like so much fun. You can find out more on the Rainbow City Facebook page.